Hey guys, so it's Monday, August 19th, and today was the first day of school, which means Alina actually started school this year. And um, I'm not sure how I feel about that yet because I still have to like process and we have to get used to it. I think I'm just in shock. And um, yeah, so I will keep you guys updated on that. But I did want to say that I want to become uh, a lot more active here on YouTube um, and make it a priority. I know I used to vlog a lot more. I used to do so many more videos, but every year of my life has brought on different challenges and different things and different requirements of me as a mother. And um, I wanna share with you this kind of next level evolved motherhood um, journey of mine. Um, for those of you guys that have been following me for a while, you know that I've been um, a working mother, a single mother, a stay-at-home mom mother, <laughs> and then a business mom. And this is the first time that I've done this flavor where um, I'm at home and the kids are all at school. In the last, um, I would say well over a decade, I've had at least one child at home with me. So this is a whole different territory for me. I became a mom at 23 and so now as I approach my 39th birthday, I get to rediscover kind of this next level of me and I'm really excited. My family is excited to see what changes and um, uh, next level comes of that. Uh, you guys know that I'm really big on reinvention and using my time really wisely and making sure that I'm um, constantly growing and evolving. So I'm excited to share this journey with you guys. So I'm starting this vlog now. It's 2.30. It's almost time for me to get the kids actually. Um, but I didn't want to rush it. I took some time this morning to just relax and get some errands run. I did go get my nails done and um, get some work done so yeah um i will start vlogging um more so yeah i plan on starting to vlog it's always awkward doing one after there's a, a break so the first thing i'll probably end up showing you guys is i went to walmart today to buy alina hair detangler and um, two hours later, I walked out with $300 worth of clothing. I had not been in the Walmart clothing section in ages, and um, they have some really cute stuff. So anyways, I bought some really, really cute things, and maybe I'll do a haul for you guys in this vlog. Stay tuned. I'm in the car line now, waiting to get the kids. I don't have a car mount yet, so I'm going to hold my phone as much as I can. Sorry if it's a little shaky. Um, if any of you guys have a good car mount that I can use for recording from my iPhone, let me know. I've been on the hunt for one. Um, so yeah, I um, came a little early here so I can just do some writing and journaling and things like that. Oh, hey, sorry about now. that. That was my old swim instructor who's actually a coach at my kid's school. So he just wanted to tell me that he also bought his wife um, the same car in the same color. Um, after he saw mine, I know she had been talking about wanting one for a while, so he went to the same dealership and ended up buying her one. Um, so totally cool. So we're gonna grab the kids now, and Irfan's already headed back home, and then we're gonna head to the Lexus dealership actually because one of my back tires is showing low pressure, and um, so I want to get that taken care of and I want to also get a car wash and then just low key in the evening just see how Alina's first day was, how the boys are doing and um, just have like a low key morning or evening routine tonight so that they can ease into it. I did have them get back into their school sleep time and wake up time for the past week and a half so they were pretty good about waking up this morning but I just want to make sure that it's not too heavy in the evening. Look at your cute LOL outfit. So the kids left uh, with their phone for school and I'm gonna have a little shot of apple cider vinegar. And this is the first time I'm trying this. It's hot water with some lime squeezed in it. I know that you're supposed to put lemon, but I don't really do well with lemon. It gives me a sore throat every time. So I prefer lime. Um, this has just really been coming up for me a lot. Like a lot of people I know have been mentioning this. Um, and so I feel like it's a sign that I need to try it out. So I'm gonna try this and I'm gonna drink this and then go meditate for about 20 minutes um, before my trainer gets here. Hey guys, so now I'm dressed and I'm waiting for my trainer to come. She comes Mondays, Wednesdays, and 
Fridays usually, but since yesterday was the first day of school, I ended up switching um, her to Tuesday for this week. So this week she'll come Tuesday, Wednesdays, and Friday, and that was going to be fantastic. Excited to get a good workout in. Excuse the boxes in the back, we're having some more work done um, on our fans and things like that. So I'm excited, let's get started. In our dance club. <laughs> Hey guys, so I just took a shower and I'm gonna get dressed now because I have two hours before my first client call so I'm thinking that I'm gonna go live stream on YouTube. Probably have like a, a boohoo party or something like that. Fun for all the moms that have just sent their kids back to school. I'm getting dressed downstairs because I actually wanna wear some of the new things that I got from Walmart which I will show you after my live stream. Hey guys, so I just finished my live stream on YouTube. It's called um, Back to School Boohoo Party, if you haven't checked that out. And now it's a little bit of me time. I got an email from Sephora with a 15% off for VIB, and I do need to stock up on a few things. So I'm gonna go to um, my cashback site that I use to get cash back, and then click through to Sephora, make my order, and right now the cashback site is offering 4% cash back. If you don't know what I'm talking about, check in the description box, I'll link it. Many of you guys use this site to, um, to sign up and what you do is they give you cash back for different vendors if you use them to click through. And it's the same for you, you don't have to pay them, the vendor pays them. So I'm gonna place my order then. Um, I think it's time, I've already had 16 hours of fast, so I'm gonna probably break my fast. I'll show you guys what I'm eating, and then I'll show you guys my clothing haul from Walmart, and then I have a client call. Let me show you what I'm wearing right now, because this is also from um, Walmart. So I've, I haven't shopped at Walmart in forever, but recently, um, I don't know if I shared this with you guys, I gained 12 pounds from last year, um, unintentional in all the right places I'm trying to get like um, I'm really attracted to that like really full curvy body right now and I've been really enjoying it so I wanted to get some clothes that fit my new body and so I got these jeans from um, Walmart they are fantastic these are the high-waisted um, like uh, what are these called the button ones and I actually ended up getting them in three colors because I love them so much. They're called, they're the no boundaries, they're called high rise sculpting skinny. So the interesting thing is that I ordered several pairs of the same type of jean from White House Black Market last week and they're not here yet, they should be coming in soon. And then I saw the same ones at Walmart for like a fraction of the price. So I got three pairs and I will compare them to the White House Black Market and see if I wanna keep the ones from White House Mar Black Market. So I'll show you the rest of the haul. I also got this top from there. I just wanted some like fun, casual things to wear, um, fitting my new body, my shape, and then, um, yeah, so I'm really liking kinda like this full body look right now. Ta-da! <laughs> I just have this newfound body love, like, like now that I know how energy works and I know that people are actually more attracted to your energy and it has nothing to do with how you look really, um, that's an illusion in our own heads, I am allowing myself to be what, I, my, what my body naturally wants to do and I've just fallen deeply in love with my body, all of it, I don't even notice the stuff that I used to worry about before and I'm just enjoying having full uh, curves and and all in the right places, um, thanks to my trainer. All credit goes to my trainer. Um, FYI, I kind of convinced her to start a YouTube channel, so fingers crossed she's gonna start a YouTube channel soon, and then I will link her, and then you guys can get some workouts from her too. She's fantastic. She's the one that's helping me gain the weight in the right places, um, so that it's not, so it's like evenly distributed where I want it to be. So anyways, let me place my Sephora order. I'll talk to you soon. So Irfan just called. He's coming home early. He hasn't been uh, feeling good. He's got a sore throat for the last couple of days. I secretly think it's because he got glutened after being grain free for like four, four or five months. Um, but he thinks he's just got a cold. So he's coming home early. We'll have lunch together 
and um, then I've got a client call so we'll wait on that Walmart haul but I'll show you guys um, I do want to just share in case anyone else wants to go grab some of these things I think definitely the sandals that I'm gonna show you and the jeans are um, like the best purchases but I like some of the tops that I got okay, too so this is what I'm breaking my fast with I have um, two hard-boiled eggs with some cayenne pepper black pepper and pink salt and then this is an Indian curry it's uh, chicken korma and then this is some grain-free bread and so that's what I'm gonna have. this is my green juice smoothie not juice green smoothie I put kale spinach cucumber ginger turmeric and then some black pepper to activate the turmeric and I'm going to squeeze some lime on top of it um, so yeah that's what I'm having and I like to use these to drink it with because you can keep mixing it so it doesn't separate my left hand ta-da really good good stuff I think I'm going on like nine years drinking green smoothies obsessed love hey guys them. so I just finished my client call and before just jumping into something else I wanted to just come out here and um, I'm barefoot I'm gonna do some grounding on my grass and also water my plants um, the water um, the plant the porch plants don't get water automatically so I do have to water them and it gives me a chance to just kind of check up on them and see how they're doing it's been really really hot here in Houston big surprise in August and some of my plants are struggling so I'm gonna water them just check up on them get some fresh air and then um, it's gonna be time to get the kids in about an hour anyways um, Irfan's leaving for his um, doctor appointment he has his annual today and we have a huge like lizard baby lizard problem so I'm being very careful where I'm walking um, but yeah let's go and water my gorgeous plants the um, porch situation right now some of my plants didn't make it like these this one um, the hydrangeas didn't make it um, what was in there begonias didn't make it it's just been really really hot um, but look monst um, what are these called monstera delicioso something like that one of my favorite plant ever this one's just loving it here so yeah okay so let's get these I usually come here barefoot so that i can kind of walk on the grass and get my earthing, done, earthing and grounding done at the same time hey guys i'm back and i'm gonna show you guys that walmart haul that i've been teasing you about all this video finally and yes i did change i had a client call and then i quickly remembered why i don't wear jeans um, especially on call days because i have to get down and meditate and do fun things with my clients on Skype and so anyways so I had just put on this dress because it just feels better to be able to meditate in this right before the call but this also gives me a chance to show you everything so let's get started okay so this is these are the jeans that I told you guys about that I was wearing earlier and I just noticed right now that they're actually made with like eco-friendly um, material. So that's kind of fun. And they are um, high-rise sculpting skinny. And I, I don't know if you can see that. Probably not. And I love that they have the buttons. They like hold everything in, give you like a nice lifted bum. And they're just really fantastic. They were $14.98 at... Uh, my local Walmart and I am a size 5 in these my only other pair of jeans that I own I own two are a size 1 in juniors and the other one are from White House Black Market size 00 neither of those definitely fit now so I'm gonna um, wear these and enjoy these so I got them in this wash black and then this dark wash And then I ended up getting this little top to wear with it um, because I, I just like that crop top and like high-waisted jean look right now that's what I'm really loving so I got this same kind of thing with this these are really like comfortable material they're kind of the crop look and um, also from Walmart everything here is from Walmart let me share prices with you um, this one was $12.96 this was $9.90 something this is the same shirt in a different color same shirt in a different color I got this one it's a cold shoulder 
Um, I had seen something similar at Boston Proper, which is another brand I really, really love. And it was like $70, and this one was at Walmart. I don't remember actually, I think it was 12. The tag part is cut off. I also got it in this color, um, in white, ivory. Then I just got one button down. And these I got three different colors. They're kind of just like loose, flowy tops that I can wear with my jeans. It's kind of funny because in the last few years, I haven't really dressed like a typical like mom, I would say, in jeans and stuff. And now that I don't have any kids home, I'm like going back to that a little bit, which is funny. I love wearing dresses because they're super comfortable. Um, but I also have been wanting to wear jeans a lot more. So anyways. <laughs> And then I got another one of those crop tops. Another one. I'll show you guys how that whole look looks when I wear them. And then I got this shirt. This reminded me of a shirt that I used to own from Express like 15 years ago. And I really like the way it feels. Super soft material. It was $9.96. It's very comfortable. Walmart sometimes has really good stuff. And I've owned stuff from them before that lasted a really, really long time. So then the only other purchase are these sandals. I got these. These were $7 each on clearance. I actually saw these on someone a while ago and just like at Disneyland or something. And I was like, oh, those are cute. And then I saw them at Walmart. So I ended up getting um, both colors. They also had these in little girls sizes. I actually got a little girls four, but um, none of the sizing for Alina, I wanted to get matching ones um, were like fully intact. There was something wrong with each one, so I ended up not getting her um, matching ones this time. Uh, we wear a lot of matching shoes, that's like our thing, because I can wear little girl size. Um, so yeah, it's 2.30, I'm cut off by my car alarm, my car line alarm. So I'm gonna go get in line to go get the kids, that's our car line, and um, then I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye. So I'm in the car now, in the car line. Um, I don't know if most of you guys understand what that is. It's when you get in line to pick up your kids, where they put your kids in your car after school. Um, I assumed everyone knew, but recently I mentioned it to some friends and they had no idea what a car line is. So it's an after school kind of pickup station thing for your kids after school. So I want to start using this time effectively Yesterday um, was the first day of school and one of my girlfriends called um, when I was in the car line So we ended up having a nice phone visit today I have my journal with me and so I'm gonna do a quick 10 minute meditation and then use the time to journal and self-reflect So do you guys have a schedule for um, what you do in the car line or a, a pick up your kids schedule? I'd love to hear from you leave in the comments uh, what you do and also what um, kind of videos you want to see in these vlogs that I'm doing for you guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!